Now we are seeing a muscle fossil that dates back 206 million years. It is called a bivalve, that is because it has two valves, it has two separate shields. As you know, mussels live underwater, attaching themselves to rocks. This attachment to rocks is a subject of biomimetics, for bivalves produce adhesives comparable in strength to human-made glues in order to make this happen. Today, however, we will talk about paleontology. This fossil is 206 million years old and was unearthed from what is today the island of Madagascar. This is a mussel 206 million years old, but by looking at it, you could assume that it belongs to a mussel of our day. As you see, there exists no difference between this fossil and the mussels of our day. It has two shells, just as the ones in our day. Its dimensions and shapes are also the same. Indeed, when looked at with an attentive eye, one can see that even the patterns are the same. As you know, mussels do not digest. They secrete an organic, inorganic substance called nacre, or more commonly, mother of pearl, on intruding objects and turn them into pearls. Mussels are also known by their trait of hosting pearls within themselves. But the most important fact is that their dimensions, shells, and everything else about them are exactly the same as with mussels in our day. When we examine only the designs and dimensions of this mussel in my hand, it becomes clear that it has no difference whatsoever from the mussels of our day. That is to say, when we look at fossils, they make one fact very clear. Fossils document life in the past, and we see how Allah creates living beings and what kind of lives they led. Because of the absence of any human beings and documents recorded at that time, we can only see these facts by looking at these pieces of rock belonging to these living beings. With these recent findings of paleontology, we can go back 206 million years and compare them to the muscles of our day, and there is no difference. And therefore, there is no evolution.